हेलो फ्रेंड्स मेनी यूजर्स हैव आस्क अस अबाउट काइरोस और ज्वेल एसीएल ट्रीटमेंट फॉर एसीएल सो इट्स अ वेरी न्यू ट्रीटमेंट एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी कवरिंग अबाउट ऑल द डिटेल्स रिगार्डिंग द काइरोस और ज्वेल एसीएल ट्रीटमेंट इट्स अ सॉर्ट ऑफ सिंथेटिक लिगामेंट व्हिच इज मेड अप ऑफ पॉलीथिलीन डायरेप्थिलेट एंड इट्स अ वूवन टिश्यू अ स्पेशल गैस ट्रीटमेंट इज डन to make the tissue hydrophilic uh, it sets very nicely into the tissues of the joint it is non reactive to the synovial tissue it's sort of a inert material inside the joint important advantages of using a kairos or a jewel acl graft is an early mobilization you don't need to wait for the grafts to heal because it is fixed and the fixation is strong on the day one itself so you can do a fast rehab early mobilization if you are using a kairos graft you can use it very quick and you can mobilize the patient very fast and this can be used to replace ligaments like acl and pcl and other ligaments and i will be covering about where you should use jewel acl or kairos treatment now this is not for all the patients but there are some specific indications in which i would recommend using a kairos treatment because for acl the standard treatment is to do a treatment of graft that is we are using any sort of a graft like btb cordyceps semitendinous and doing an acl reconstruction but there but there are some specific scenarios where we would like to use this jewel acl treatment now this is as you all know is a sort of a woven textile material which is contoured in the shape of your ligament per se it has got a good long term data to support its use uh, it has got the strength which is almost similar to your native ligament strength that is about 1200 newtons precisely about 1296 newtons so it is almost the same strength as that of your native acl uh, the quality of the graft is good now you can use it in two ways you can use it either in a total graft sparing way that is you just use a stand alone uh, kairos or you can do a kairos with a graft so it's a partial graft sparing approach so total graft sparing approach in which no graft is used and partial graft sparing approach in which a part of the graft is used along with the kairos covering to make a new ligament both of the approach are fine and you have different indications of using both now whenever you are using a uh, kairos never use a biodegradable screw or a biocomposite screw it is imperative that you use a peak screw or a titanium screw because these are not going to heal these are going to stay as it is and there will be a fibrous ingrowth in between the textile uh, woven material so it will be like a fibrous tissue which will grow inside the tissue if there is a graft this will incorporate into the tissue so whenever you are using these grafts try to use a more uh, inert materials uh, screws like a peak screw or a metallic screw the graft itself is, is inert and there is very less chance of any reaction to the graft in the joint so it's a basically it's a inert sort of a material now where to use it now you can use it in selected circumstances like if you the patient is a mucoid acl and if you need to do a selective debridement you can use it you can use it in revision scenarios where all the grafts of patient have been used then the, the, the patient is graft deficient you can use that then you can use this in multi ligament scenarios where you need to use a lot of ligaments then you can use it then if there are scenarios in which you want to do a partial ligament reconstructions if one bundle of acl is intact only one bundle is torn then you can use it and then if you want to do augmentations in acl pcl avulsions then also you can do it without touching the native ligament so there are specific conditions in which i would like to do a kairos graft and it they overall it's it's better than the earlier synthetic grafts in which the results were not good earlier the carbon fiber grafts were used whose the results was not good but they, with this the results have been promising the only negative factor at present is the cost which is little bit higher Uh, because uh, it it's a, it's a it's a graft which needs to be um, uh, purchased and used so it's it's little costly but in selected circumstances i can uh, i can vouch that it's a very good material to be used in acl and pcl and other ligament reconstruction settings friends if you have any more questions you can get back to us on the numbers given below if you have any more questions you can write it down on the comment box thanks a lot